Hi there, this is Renee from Floating Lights Photography. You're watching another episode of Focus Wednesdays, and today I'm going to show you how to bring the true color back into a photo. So I usually take my photos with my white balance set to auto. I know that's a bad thing and I probably shouldn't do it, but I do. And that's fine, but sometimes my photos, when they come straight out of camera, they have a little bit of a color cast to them. So they look a little bit cooler or sometimes they even look a little bit warmer. And I want to bring back the true color of the photo to the image before I do any further editing to it. So I'm going to show you how to bring true color back into your photo before you edit it. So the first thing we're going to do is go down to the little adjustment layer icon down here. This is the circle half circle and we're going to select a new levels adjustment layer and we're going to use the histogram for this. So the first thing we actually want to do is change our channel from the RGB channel to the red channel and we're going to adjust our sliders. So in case you're unaware this is our histogram and this is the red channel of the histogram and what we want to do is bring our highlights and shadow sliders to where the red channel starts and ends on the histogram. So we want to slide the black slider or the shadow slider up to where the red kind of starts on the histogram. It's right about there. And we're going to bring the highlights slider down to where the red kind of ends on the histogram, which is right about there. So we're going to do this for all three channels. We're going to do it for the green channel and the blue channel as well. So again, we're going to move the shadow slider up to where the green channel starts on the histogram and we're going to bring the highlights slider down to where the green channel kind of ends at the histogram and we'll do the same thing for blue as well. And you can see here's the before, here's the after. It's really just popped the colors and made the colors a little bit more true. Um, the issue with this now though is bringing the highlight slider down actually makes the image brighter and we don't want to do that for this image. So you can see the before and the after, it's a lot brighter. And to change that is really quite simple. We just need to change the blend mode of our layer. So from normal, we're going to select from the drop down list color. And it's really just adjusting the color then. It's not adjusting the brightness or the shadows at all. So you can see the before, here's the before. It's kind of dreary and on the cooler side and we hit the after with the color changes that we've made and it brings out the true color in the image. And so we're going to do that to one more photo here. Same thing here, this image isn't bad, it's just a little bit on the cooler side. My white balance was a little bit off and I want to bring out the true colors in the photo. So we're going to go down and select a new levels adjustment layer. We're going to change our channel to red and we're going to move our slider to where the color starts on the histogram. We'll do the same thing with the green and the blue slider or and the blue channels as well. You can see how quickly this is done and here's the before and after again it brightened it quite a bit so I'm just going to go down to color and just adjust the color so again here's the before it's a little bit on the cooler side and here's the after with the true color. So I really hope you've enjoyed the tutorial. If you have any questions, you can always email me at hello at floatinglightsphoto.com or you can find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash floatinglightsphotography. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.